The pictures show a zinc strip dipped into copper 2 sulfate solution and a copper strip dipped into zinc sulfate solution. Predict which setup, A or B, will result in a chemical reaction. Why? Yes. Setup A will result in a chemical reaction because zinc, a more reactive metal, can displace copper, a less reactive metal, from copper to sulfate solution. This reaction is called displacement reaction. Observe the video. Copper deposits form on the zinc strip and the blue solution fades. During the reaction, energy released is in the form of heat. Let's measure how much heat energy is released during the reaction. 50 cubic centimeters of 0.25 mole per cubic decimeter copper 2 sulfate solution is poured into a polystyrene cup. The initial temperature of the solution is measured with a thermometer. Record the reading in the table provided. Excess zinc powder is poured into the copper 2 sulfate solution. Stir the mixture and record the highest temperature of the mixture in the table provided. What is the difference in temperature during the reaction? Key in your answer in the table. Now, with the data we have, we can calculate the heat released from the reaction. How do we do this? Key in the data in the blanks and find out the heat released during the reaction. Yes, the heat released during the displacement reaction is 2.73 kilojoules. What would be the amount of energy released when one mole of copper is displaced from its solution? Let us calculate together. First, calculate the number of moles of reactants used in the reaction to find out the number of moles of copper displaced. Click Hint if you need some help. Yes, 2.73 kilojoules of heat is released when 0.0125 moles of copper is displaced from its solution by zinc. But how much energy would be released if one mole of copper is displaced from its solution by zinc? Key in the data in the empty boxes to calculate your answer. Yes. The energy released when one mole of copper is displaced from its solution by zinc is 218.4 kilojoules. The energy released when one mole of substance is displaced is called the heat of displacement. Thus, we can say that the heat of displacement of copper from its solution by zinc is negative 218.4 kilojoules per mole. The negative sign in front of the value indicates that heat is released. We can write the thermochemical equation for the displacement of copper from its solution by zinc like this. What does the energy level diagram for the displacement of copper from its solution by zinc look like? Let's draw. Study the flowchart. Use this to guide you in solving the problem involving heat of displacement. 3.25 grams of zinc powder is added to the 25 cubic centimeters of 2 mole per decimeter copper 2 sulfate solution during the reaction. The temperature of the mixture increased by 9 degrees Celsius. Answer the following questions. Key in your answer in the boxes provided.